بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم المحاضرة بعنوان Diseases of Nervous System Part 2 we, we talk about the diseases of nervous system and we divided the diseases of nervous system how we can diagnose it now we come for, uh, specifically for the disease of nervous system we have first we talk about some technical terms we use in the clinic such as encephalitis and inflammation of the brain, myelitis and inflammation of the spinal cord, neuritis and inflammation of the nervous tissue, nerve tissue, meningitis and inflammation of meninges, brain covering, uh, pachymeningitis and inflammation of the dura mater, uh, liptomeningitis and inflammation of the biometers, uh, neuralgia, pain along the course of the nerve, ataxia, failure of muscular coordination or irregularity between several membranes of a group of muscles without paresis, paralysis, or voluntary movement. A tremor, a tumbling, hint, rapid, intermittent, contraction relatively of short period, while the spasm is abnormal muscular contraction. Another technical term, somnolence, sleepness, the patient stands with head dropping and the eyes closed, stupor, disturbance of equilibrium when standing, less mute, tiredness, weakness, Sinicopenting, loss of consciousness caused by inadequate glucose or oxygen to the brain causing neurogenic, neurogenic or cardiovascular disturbance, coma, loss of consciousness with absence of reflex, and loss of muscular tones, but the cardiac and respiratory function are still maintained. Nystigmas, rapid rhythmic size-to-size -size movement of the eye. There are some technical adopts of investigating neurological disorder of how we can diagnose the nervous system disease number one clinical neurological examination we have to do this one a previous clinical approach is highly effective for diagnosis prognosis and treatment radiological examination radioisotope scanning using the special technique and electroencephalo graph which we call eeg uh, to record the electrical activity of cerebral cortex and interrupt function state of cortex Number five, neuroophthalmology. The optic nerve is a part of the brain and lesion of the brain, and the brain system are reflected in the form of the ophthalmological symptoms. For example, brain edema is characterized by below edema and protrusion of the optic disc. And stigmas and voluntary escalation of the eyeball is concerned with the lesion of cerebral vestibular apparatus, non functional droopy eyelids and associated with certain cranial nerve paralysis. Number six, nerve conduction velocity. Here the, the, the rate of passage of nerve on pulse following the direct stimulus is recorded. This is applied to diagnose paresis and paralysis. Number seven, cerebrospinal fluid pressure. It increase in cases of vitamin, vitamin A deficiency, increase in cranial uh, contains such as a tumor, abscesses, hydroencephalus, congenital inflammation, meningitis, encephalitis. It also increases in cases of shock, hypotension, long standing degenerative disease. We now we taking specifically diseases of the brain. It included encephalitis, encephalomalacia, hemorrhage of the brain, hydroencephalus, cerebral anemia. Uh, sun or heat stroke, coheria, neurosis, sun neurosis, epilepsy, toxoplasmosis, cryptospirosis, tick paralysis, dysteresis, and cerebrospinal hematodics and inflammation. Encephalitis, it is meaning the inflammation of the encephalon brain characterized by initial hyperexcitivity followed by paralysis and unconsciousness. It may be primary or secondary or a consequence to other diseases. Etiology, it's viral disease such as sporadic bovine encephalomyelitis, bovine malignant catarrh, rabies, infectious, uh, bovine rhinotrichitis, while in horses, infectious encephalomyelitis, sheep and goat scare is pretty looping ill, and indoor canine distemper. Number two, bacterial lesion or bacterial agents is called, including listeria, necrocacillus, enterotoxemia, salmonellosis, erythrocyclus. Parasitic agents including migrating of larvae, multisepsa, multisepsa, toxoplasmosis, and nervous coccidiosis. Toxic agents including lead, arsenic, salt poisoning, ipoma plant. Fungal agents including cryptococcus.
The pathogenesis of the disease, including infecting agents, cause irritation and degenerative changes in the brain tissue, formation of multiple foci of microabscess, then the lesion depends on the size and nature and severity of the lesion and the causative agents. There may be acute edematous swelling. This may obstruct the blood flow and interfere with cerebral function. Uh, there is a gradual increase in the intracranial pressure and irreversible brain injury is associated with cervical rigidity, ataxia, tumors, convulsion, followed by coma and paralysis. The clinical signs including high rise of temperature, fever, mania, aggressiveness, depression, and disturbance, circling movement, head pressing, clonic compulsion, muscular tremors, and pounding on the ground, frothy salivation from commissure of mouth, Jumping of jaw and hyperesthesia, depression of consciousness, spastic sites of paralysis may be in either sides, ataxia or in coordination of gaze, the stigmas of the eyeball, unilateral facial paralysis due to listeriosis, blindness of the eye reflex, prostruction, unable to stand straight is the ground, and depth doubles. The clinical pathology, including examination of cerebrospinal fluid CSF, or for biochemical, cerebrovascular, cellular, and microbiological uh, aspects. Diagnosis and differential diagnosis, we have to divide to diagnose from acute cerebral edema, poisoning, vitamin A deficiency, encephalomalacia, meningitis. The treatment is depending on the complete phase, try to remove the preterial cause, use sedative and tranquilizer during the excitement stage, Nervous stimulus if there is depression, high dose of a broad spectrum antibiotic for five, seven days, and use of corticosteroid to reduce the uh, inflammation, specific antidotes if there is poisonings, specific treatments for specific agents, use of parenteral fluids for nourishment and dehydration, use of mannitol to reduce intracranial pressure. The second disease is cephalomalacia. It is a degenerative disease or degenerative changes of the brain that causes either nutritional deficiency or infectious causes such as in clostridium brachyngis type D, bulky kidney, ingestion of toxic chemicals, hepatic encephalopathy. The pathogenesis it occurs as a result of endothelial injury. Clinical symptoms it may be acute or sub. The acute forms is including muscle tremors, frothy, salivation, chronic compulsion, obsessiveness, condition, uh, stigmas of eyeball, gaze within 24 hours. While the subacute forms including anorexia, depression, ataxia, circling movement, head depressing, atonia of Roman, bradycardia, severe weakness. The diagnosis is depending on the disease is occurs in an animal and it should be differentiated from blood poisoning, vitamin A deficiency. The treatment is depending on the, the disease if is irreversible, but apply supportive treatment including big complex fresh Roman juice, corticosteroids to reduce the intracranial pressure. The cerebral apoplexia or hemorrhage in the brain, this is the rupture of the blood vessels in the brain and causes hemorrhage. It may this condition may occur in cattle, horses, and dogs. The etiology High increase in the blood pressure during violent exertion or parturition, traumatic injury of the skull. The symptoms is depend on the nervous shore, the intracranial pressure rates with the lethargy, coma and death, the form uh, hair and trauma will compress on part of the brain, causing loss of function, the breathing is slow and snorous. Treatment is depending on keep the animal quiet and calm place, apply cold compress to the head, elevate the head above the body levels, give laxative and diuretic system units are contraindicated, and do not attempt to push the animal to stand. A slowly injection, intravenous injection of 50% sucrose, 1 ml per body weight. The hydrocephalus is another disease of the brain, including it is accumulation of cerebrospinal fluid in the cerebral ventricles due to defect in the normal drainage of the cerebrospinal fluid. The etiology either congenital or acquired. 
The symptoms is the gradual onset of the general paralysis, depression, disinclination to move, chewing is a slow, intermittent, and incomplete reaction to cutaneous stimul stimulation is reduced, the frequent stumbling and coordination and abnormal posture, bradycardia, and cardiac arrhythmia. Diagnosis is dependent on them, must be differentiated from encephalitis and treatment. There is no treatment for the hydrocephalus. The, another case is the cerebral anemia, anoxia, cerebral ischemia. Cerebral anoxia occurs when the supply of oxygen of the brain is reduced. This may be acute or chronic, depending on the severity of the deprivation. Sudden and etiology, sudden and severe loss of blood on general anemia due to chronic loss of blood, acute hydrocyanic acids or nitrate poisoning, acute cardiac failure, <coughs> such as in falling disease and cattle cover deficiency, terminal states of pneumonia and congestive heart failure, sudden rush of blood from the brain to internal organs as N2, rapid removal or of transudate or oxidative from body cavity, sudden evacuation of gas from tympanic stomach, allergic shocks, increase intracranial pressure with compression of the cerebral vessels. Symptoms is depend on acute cerebral anoxia is manifested by loss of consciousness, muscular tremor, chronic compulsion, vomiting may occur, the mucous membrane is dull and the pupils dilated. A chronic cerebral anoxia are manifested by dull mucous membrane, lethargia, dullness, ataxia, muscle tumors, or compulsion in some cases. Differential diagnosis, hypoglycemia, in which similar signs occurs, late and arsenic poisoning and encephalitis prognosis is favorable as long as the pupil can react to light. If there is no reaction, especially when there is compulsion, the prognosis is high. A treatment is dependent on the removal of the real cause, respiratory stimulants, artificial respiration, injection of stimulants or fast comfort with the head in lower position than the body levels to supply the brain. The second, the other cases is a sun stroke or heat strokes. It's affection not necessary due to exposure of the sun rays, but also to action of a great heat combined with increased humidity. This frequently results from direct exposure of the sunrise during the hot season, but let us say, also an ability to respire readily is a predisposing factor. Etiology, direct exposure of the animal to sunrise during hot and humid weather, heavy air, heavy hair coat or fatty animals in a crowded area or hot and humid weather, uh, damage of the hypothalamus due to spontaneous hemorrhage, inadequate water in the intake, and insufficiency of the tissue of fluid. Pathogenesis, heat stroke will cause vasodilatation of the cranial vessels that results in a drop in the blood pressure, respiration increase in rate and depth, and temperature is elevated and the heart rate becomes fast and irregular, the urine secretion is reduced. The symptoms is depending on the sudden onset of the animal stop working and refuse to continue. A staggering gait, mucous membranes are congested, pulse is fast and irregular. The temperature is elevated over 42. Hyperthermia, convulsion are evident on the animal size or state of coma within two hours. Diagnosis, the condition should be excluded from acute infective disease to treatment. Put the animal in a well ventilated shade place, cool place, separate the patient with cold water and apply ice pack to the head. Circulatory stimulants and vasoconstruction are indicated, such as comfort and oil for large uh, animals and uh, small animals, hypodermic, uh, hypodermically, uh, intravenous dextrose saline solution slowly. When the body temperature begins to fall, circulate or stop cold water because rapid drop of temperature below the normal is dangerous. The second case is a neurosis of a pregnancy, parturition, and lactation. This is in, occurs in milk fever, gracetina, acetonemia, neurosis, and or neuritis. And this case is, we will take it in details in next year in metabolic diseases. Senorosis or senora cerebralis is our story which we call synonym story is the disease caused by presence of multisepsis, yarakat, 
do the shredder multi substance in the brain which inhibits the small intestine of the dogs and fox. It occurs mostly in sheep, much more rarely. In other herbivores, in the following order of the frequency, cattle, goat, horses, camels, and rabbits. Causes the problem. Teeny multi substance inhibits the small intestine of the dogs. Infestation occurs as a result of ingestion of proglutoids of tape worm from grass or water contaminated with the feces of infested dogs. Symptoms in sheep. The first stage of acute meningeal encephalitis began 10 to 14 days after invasion. And the second stage, after three to six months, the disturbance of consciousness uh, from an increased intracranial pressure, the animal lifts the, uh, the feet too high in walking, head is lowered or rise in the air, epileptic attack, circular movement. Treatment called compression on the head, uh, terpening and removal of the cyst. The second, the, another case is toxoplasmosis. The clinical signs in cults are dyspnea, cough, fever, tremors, and shaking of the head, grinding of the teeth, death after two to three, six days. In adults, there is hyper excitability, excitability more than depression in the early state. Diagnosis is dependent on the demonstration of the organism. Postmortem uh, uh, showing mild hyperemia or no lesion in the center of the system into toxin acts as on the control and on not on the peripheral nervous system. One of the important cases which we face it in the clinic is the tick paralysis. A rapidly progressive ascending reflexive paralysis is occur if you remove the, if you remove the ticks without carefully removing uh, its cause of tick paralysis. It first affects the hind legs and eventually may reach the medulla oblongata and death results from respiratory failure. Calves, sheep, goats, dogs, and cats are affected as well as man. Recovery without the treatment may occur in sheep in 48 hours. Dipping or spraying will stop the disease quickly in a block. Therefore, we have to control the ticks infestation in animals. Listeriosis is one of the important diseases, although it affects the animal and the causes is listeria monocytogen. The symptoms are those of encephalitis and the brain lesion. Listeria isolated from the abscess of the liver, from lymph nodes, the lymph nodes, spleen, heart, and spinal cord. And cattle of all ages are affected. The affected cow show a dullness and isolates herself from the other herds. The cow may circle at pasture. The circling become evident. She is confirmed to a yard. Uh, the disease is insotic, may appear in teeth, and diagnosis symptoms, serological test not successful. It should be differentiated from rabies and late poisoning. Treatment by penicillin and intravenous sulfamethasin. The disease, the, all these uh, previously is the diseases of the brain. We have to take now the disease of meninges. Disease of meninges and including Meningitis, it is an inflammation of meninges. It affects the brain and the spinal cord. Etiology, bacterial, viral, and extension from inflammation from other, it causes, uh, from other inflammation, it causes encephalitis. Mode of infection, and bacterial infection, infection is usually hematogenous, sporadic case occurs as a result of penetrating wounds of the skull, as a result of umbilical infection in newly born animals. The symptoms is depending on the onset of the disease is sudden, fever and toxemic cutaneous hyperesthesia, tonic spasm of the neck muscles, respiration is usually slow and deep, and excitement mania followed by convulsion finally death. The diagnosis is depending on the a clinical signs, cerebrospinal fluid examination, and the treatment depends on the antibacterial drug for long periods, 7 to 10 days, analgesic in severe pain, oral sustenance in chronic cases, and intra, uh, intrathecal administration, intrathecal administration of, drug, of drugs is advisable uh, in severe cases. Diseases of spinal cord, they include traumatic injury, myelitis, traumatic injury, this sudden severe trauma of the spinal cord causes complete flaccid paralysis caused to the injury. The etiology is dislocation of the or fracture of the vertebrae, confusion or confusion without structural damage to the bones of the vertebral column, migrating of some larvae, such as the nematoidal, is also the causes of 
disease. The lesion causes compression on the nervous tissue due to the displaced bone or hematoma. The initial response is that of spinal shock, which is manifested by complete flaccid paralysis. The lesion must be affected at least the ventral third of the cord before spinal shock occurs. The symptoms is including the spinal images, the spinal shock manifested by flaccid paralysis, fall of blood pressure and vasodilatation, local sweating extremities are affected and the animal unable to rise himself or herself. Anesthesia occurs at, at and caudal of the, to the lesion and the hyperesthesia may be observed at the anterior edge of the lesion due to irritation by local inflammation and edema. There is no systemic disturbance but pain may cause anorexia and an increase in heart rate. Recovery may occur within one to three weeks. It may be delay and it may be not occur. Diagnosis is depending on the history and symptoms x-ray. The treatment is depending on the careful nursing or deep cutting, massage of bony prominence and periodic touching. The second disease of the uh, spinal cord is myelitis. It is an inflammation of the spinal cord, which is usually associated with the viral encephalitis. The initial signs of initiation are followed by signs of loss of function. This is common if rabies may be ended by the paralysis. Viral diseases of cerebrospinal of central nervous system in animals. Uh, uh, from this is taken from the blood and Henderson disease or veterinary medicine uh, book and uh, this is the diseases of meningitis meningoencephalitis and also this is uh, the uh, tables sciatic paralysis is one of the uh, diseases it occur in especially in some cow it is uh, it causes a prolonged unilateral recumbency secondary to femoral neck or pelvic fracture uh, tubes uh, ischium, septic infection arising from intramuscular injection, clinical signs the limbs is entirely non-weight bearing, the limbs hangs loosely and there is forward jerky while the animals attempt to walk, walk sensation is lost from the limb distal to the uh, stable except the medial aspects of the middle metatarsal region. Prognosis is hopeless so that early slaughter is advisable. Tibial nerve paralysis it is rare in animals. It's caused by paralysis of the extensor of the hook, hook and a flexor of the digits resulted in, uh, in a slightly flexed petlock while the sole is in opposition with the ground. Other paralysis is including spastic paralysis, tenuous paralysis in contractile stage, flaccid paralysis and indic indicates paralysis in relax uh, relaxation stage. This is also table. You can use it if you, to see the lesion of the nerves of the thoracic limbs in neurological examination. Thank you very much.